Okay, they're going to be starting on Metal City. Excellent. Open Bracket asks, what are your thoughts on the fastest? Thoughts on the fastest? Well, it's uh, pretty good on on gears that, I mean, on stages that uh, are primarily cruising stages, uh, or rather air deficiency stages. But um, it does have huge susceptibility and uh, huge vulnerability to high boosting gears. So gears that can catch up to it uh, in an instant and hit it. Uh, yeah. Big Rock's picking up Knuckles on the default gear versus Azure's Kale's once again on the high booster on Metal City. Playing type is a good pick up on Ooh, Metal City. Great start by that. both of them. Really good start by both of them, but Vigrox hits Azure with the hot level one attack, gets the high route too. Picks yeah. up a lot of rings on the top route, nearly at 20 rings. And this is really detrimental for Azura because when you get hit, not only do you lose all your rings, which didn't matter because it was the initial interaction, but you lose your air, which for high booster, once it's in the critical range, it can't boost anymore, of course. Very important. Yes, very very uh, important interaction. This actually could uh, result in a huge lead, as we're seeing right now. hitting the level 2 before lap 1 is over, just one ring away from entering double 3 into lap 2. Azure two rings away, gets the level two, just as Vagrox hits his level three, hits the top route again, further increasing his ring lead over Azure. Azura having, uh, using high booster, high booster has a better time output on this stage than default gear, so a comeback could be made. We just have to see that level three and then we're in business. Gets the big ring box from the flight route. This yep. is why he's picking flight on the high booster. Getting that big 286 boost with the high booster. A very interesting play by Azura. Big Rock's failing the jump, not getting very much air back. Gonna have to plow through the power route a little more to get some air back. Fortunately, burning a lot of air on this drift. Azura is still lagging behind a little bit, but getting the higher out, the high booster will be able to boost straight down it, but it will start to run out of air. He's going to have to hit the high, the flight path to get some air back. But the high booster's late game strength might not matter much, with Vigrox already landing the higher out, final higher out, That's taking the it. first game. Wow, that initial interaction was actually so detrimental. Uh, Azuri should Very have probably... Very strong early game start from yeah. Big Rock. Mm -hmm. Ste effectively stealing Azur's first high booster. Placing in second against Big Rock. By detrimental first place by nearly 20 seconds. Her once again picking up tails on the high booster. It seems to be his thing. This is Vigrox's Rouge once again on the default gear. Won't have to lose any speed cruising up the jumps. Very similar to the Legend, but does not auto complete the jump for you. On Splash Canyon, two flight pickups. Very intelligent from both of them. Azure wanting to hit. Can the high booster attack actually? Uh, yes. Huh. Attempting to hit Vagrox with the level 1 attack as Vagrox did in the first race, but not landing it. Vagrox getting the higher out, getting that extra speed, hitting the auto section early. Having a slight ring lead over Azure, hitting the flight route, will they land the flight skip? Azure, very, very fundamental skip, display. very easy to perform, but yeah. pulls it off anyway. I've seen it failed before, you still can't rest on your lures trying to go for that skip. Both of them land the higher out. Big Rocks with the hot level 2. Having a, a great lead over Azure now. Never mind, Azure picking up the lucky item box to get 
suddenly get a eight ring lead over Big Rock. Big Rock still cruising ahead in first though, getting the higher up, but Azure follows him this time. Going into the auto section. Big Rock's once again landing the flight scout. Azure trailing not too far behind with a 10 ring lead over him. Only needs one more ring to hit the level three. Gonna try and coast coast until he's one ring, gets the level three, gonna start cruising behind Big Rock now. This is really High bad. Boosting down the straight. Oh, right out of the range of turbulence. Very Let's see a trick right here. You won't be able to ride the turbulence. Big Rock's not landing the higher up. This might be Azure's chance to really come back, but Big Rock's hits the level three, going into the flight route way before Azure even lands. Azure's trying to cut corners, getting the flight skip effectively. But Vigrox lands the high rock, gonna get the speed boost from those successful tricks and the rainbow. Boosting down, finishing his second win, knocking out Azure in only two races. Entering himself into the next bracket while dropping Azure down into loser. Did not see either of them hit that initial top route in order to get those 30 ring boxes, which would have been a very strong level 3 start from either of them. I hope to see some of that achieved in later races on Splash Canyon. Mm -hmm. Very well played from both parties, however. Azure doing much better that game. Not falling to Vagrox's level 1 hit right at the start gate. Come, intentionally coming out a little slower behind Vague Rocks just to avoid that attack. Oh, what did you think you did? Up. Bro, I was way too, bro, I was way too nervous. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I saw and, it. It's kind of crazy. Getting, that, getting hit with that attack right there at the beginning of Metal City, like, just ended that race for me right oh, then. Oh, yeah, there. for sure. Me and Protag were talking about it. Losing that much air right at the beginning of the race is very detrimental to the high boost. Right. I was actually considering like a, a tails with like a darkness combination so I could conserve all my air, but that probably would have been better if you had tournament nerves because you can right. uh, <laughs> you can press that B button more, you know? Yeah, I'm not pressing that. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Definitely could have caught up a lot easier with my boost. The high booster was serving you a lot better in uh, the second race on Splash Canyon, though. That's okay. Keep up with big rocks a lot better. Between the ashes of losers.